such as have deployed drones to search for two passengers still unaccounted for after Nepal's deadliest plane crash in 30 years, which killed at least 70 people. Meanwhile, it has emerged that the co-pilot of the ill-fated flight lost her husband in a plane crash 16 years earlier. Wada was co-piloting Yeti Airlines Flight 691. Her husband, Deepak Pokrel, had also been co-piloting a Yeti Airlines flight when he died. It was his death that spurred Anju to pursue a career in aviation. The plane was flying from Kathmandu to tourist town of Pokhara. Difficult terrain and inclement weather have been hampering rescue efforts. Searchers found two more bodies on Monday before the search was called off because of fading light. On Monday, searchers found the cockpit voice recorder and flight data recorder from the flight, both in good condition, which could help investigators determine what caused the crash. Elsewhere, China's population has fallen for the first time in 60 years. According to the China's National Bureau of Statistics, the national birth rate is a record low since the birth rate per 1,000 people. The population in 2022 of 1.4118 billion fell by 850,000 from 20. China's birth rate has been declining for years, prompting a raft of policies to slow the trend. Deaths also outnumbered births for the first time last year. China logged its highest death rate since 1976 at 7.37 deaths per 1,000 people, up from 7.18 the previous year.